everyone, and welcome back to Persona 5. I have been running errands all day, so I am tired. Uh, hello, Faku, Billy, Bill, Akatsuki, Daniel, Jeff. Thank you for joining us. Uh, we're just going to have a chill time with our friends, uh, including Ryuji, who is uh, just letting me know he's open to hang out, but I think I have my like highest friendship level with Ryuji, so... He, need, he needs to chill for a bit. Uh, on? I don't know how, what level is on. We'll have to look her, her up. Yusuke, he's waiting around. Ah, ah, ah. Yes, we are getting very close. I was thinking about that the other day. We're only like three chapters away from the original game's ending. Uh, no, we can. We can wait. I think I do need to probably hang out with Makoto. Probably low on her. Hello, Sakura. Welcome. Hey, Dad. Hey. I can't be friends with Dad yet, can I? Or at least not to the extent I am other people. Alright, so we could... Oh, we could... Yusuke could go up. Uh, Makoto could go up, and I think Makoto's probably lower, so we should probably do Makoto. And we really should go to Kanda and meet What's-Her-Face. Hmm. We got plenty of time. We have, we have some time. We will start with Makoto, I think. Just because I feel like she is, uh, probably low level. Ah, you've been playing four? I need to get around to that. Once this is done, we are gonna go on a SMT spree. Though, so we might start with some older Hello? games because I want to play them. Uh, they are all so long! Uh. Alright, let's hang out with Makoto! Thank you. What do you think? Is this blasphemy? Nah, it's not blasphemy. It's totally fair to be annoyed by Morgana because it points Morgana is uh, written not that great. I love Morgana on Excuse me. the fact that Morgana is a cat. And I will always love Cat, and he looks like Bob, and I love him. Uh, you've been spending time in the red light district lately, haven't you? I know you've been being naughty, because you have a side ponytail. We saw you there. Where you were heading, we assume you're working at a store called the After School Salon, a little on the nose. How is it working there? It's a normal cafe. They make me wear a costume, but that's it. Uh, don't... Excuse me. Uh, don't have to do anything. It's totally legal. Hmm. You're sure nothing strange is going on. Worst I get is some weird old guys gawking at me. Is Why are you he... working there? How's your financial situation? I can just ask my parents for cash whenever I want. Oh, I see. But they totally bug me about why. That's why I work at the salon. I did get some good spending money, plus the guys who come in there, like, mega tamper me. I'm saying this wrong, so... I get some good spending money, plus the guys who come in there are, like, mega pamper me. Hmm. It's nice having people treat you like you're special, you know? I'm sure a super honor student like you gets that all the time, though. Anyways, are you gonna tell on me you even brought a witness? Hold up, doesn't that mean you two were in Shinjuku together? What's up with that, Miss Pris? So what if we were together? Aww. Don't say that, it could be taken the wrong way! Come on, we're besties! It was simply an errand I asked him to accompany me on, that's it. At any rate, don't mind him. As for you, I don't plan on telling anyone. Oh, I get it. So we're like protecting each other's secrets. Oh crap, and I just realized your boyfriend's that rumored criminal. You're a real badass, Miss Prez. I told you that's not how it is. I was just worried you were getting wrapped up in some shady business, so I asked him here for support. Honestly, I probably will romance Makoto again. Cause just storyline wise, it's so cute. Those two being like team mom and team dad, and the the, the story leans you hard towards her. If I got a romance only a lady, Makoto makes sense. And obviously they're all just like open and in love with each other anyway, so who cares? Uh, <laughs> a reprisal of my April May voice. You're not wrong. Uh, is that a Buchi Marukun pencil case? Huh? You know Buchi Marukun? 
I had like tons of Bucci stuff back when I was a kid. What a blast from the past. Why is it so beat up? Well, it was given to me when I was in elementary school. I'd like to buy a new one, but they've stopped selling Bucci Marikun merchandise. OMG, this is too hilarious. The student council president has an adorable pencil case. My image of you has done like a complete 360 today. Uh, isn't that a full circle? <laughs> mm, I don't know, I'm just real surprised. You don't really look like the kind of person who'd be into that stuff. I mean, I always thought you were kind of like a robot, but I guess I just had to get to know you better. Why don't we trade phone numbers? I really want to talk to you more about Buchimaru-kun and your boyfriend. Uh, oh, okay. <laughs> Accidentally making a friend. <laughs> He's not my boyfriend. I'm saved. Oh, crap. It's this late already? I've got to get to work. I'll send you tons of pics of my Buchimaru collection later, though. Bye-bye. I'm gonna miss you, lady. Gandalf, what are you doing? Oh, <laughs> he just jumped right out of my hands. I don't know if y'all saw that on the camera, but he just jumped. Scoot that a little over. No, you don't go for my plate. It's empty and there's nothing on it, but I know that's what you're wanting. You want to lick the plate. Bad boy. Hello, Sapphire and Alexis and other people I have not said hello to. Thanks for joining us. Uh, she was all over the place. Honestly, though, I'm in shock. She thought I was a robot? <laughs> oh, no! Beep boop! Don't let it get to you. I won't. I'm aware of how one could perceive me that way. You know, I believe what Takao said, San said about me is how others think as well. I thought I'd changed after the incident with Kaneshiro, but perhaps it wasn't enough. Baby, they don't know you. That aside, it was almost inspiring to meet someone so distinct from myself. I'm going to try to look at things a little differently from now on. Wow. And well, I think that will help me break out of my shell. I hope you're ready. I'm going to show you how useful an honor student can really be. So precious. Yay! All right. I'll be interested to speak with Takao-san some more now that I have her contact. Perhaps I can correct her misconceptions about you. And as always, I'll let you know if anything important happens. I'll see, see you later. later. Hello, thanks for sitting in with me today. It really did help. I got a message from Takao-san earlier. She turned out to be quite a fan of Buchimaru-kun. It was crazy to see a picture of her entire collection. She even has a bunch of Buchimaru-kun emoticons. Sounds like you two get along. I guess you're right. Is this what friendship is? I didn't expect to bond over something like this, though. I'm pretty shocked, to be honest. Though I'm still a little worried about the store she works at. I'll try a little harder to get through to her about it. I might come to you for more advice later. For now, I'll let you go. Talk to you later. Ah, you're back. Inmate. I didn't know you had my phone number. I trust you haven't forgotten about your special assignment. We'll be waiting in front of our door. We expect you to accept this task with enthusiasm. <laughs> Utaba's still asleep. It's been a whole day. Way too impatient. Clam down! That's a reference to another YouTube video. <laughs> there is a, uh, the, the, the McElroy brothers do goofy videos on video games, and there was one they were playing an online game, and making jokes in the chat, in the, like, whole ch channel. I don't know how online... They were talking to strangers on the internet and being dorks about it, and somebody tried to tell them that they were being, uh, uh, rude or something and said, try to say calm down, but they accidentally spelled clam. <laughs> and he said, clam down, and so he went, no, you clam down! <laughs> That's what I think of whenever I see the words calm down now, is clam down. I understand why you guys feel nervous, but we'll just have to wait for now. Everybody clam down. 
Oh yeah, I'm not gonna use that. That's silly. Waste of time. Housekeeping service. Any uh yeah 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 yeah. yeah. Alright, let's look at who we want to prioritize. Uh, that one goes up with the plot line. Oh, use case is really low. Um, we can do his later. Okay, Ryuji's almost done. Um, so let's look at our map. It's what day? It's Wednesday. Can we hang out with Akechi on Wednesdays? Iwa, Kawakami. We still don't have enough points to hang out with Iwa. And we don't... Oh, no, I have enough money to do the fortune teller, so we might want to... I mean, what do you guys think? Should I try and do every confidant, or should I focus on finishing the cool ones? I mean, I can't do his yet. I guess I could just do her. Oh. If I can't do any of the important ones. Oh, but there's Hifumi. Yeah, I'd rather do Hifumi. Of all four, though, well, three, really, because he was not unlocked. Hifumi! Hey, hey! That girl's playing Shogi. Maybe she's Hifumi Togo, the one Yusuke mentioned. Why don't you ask her? Hello. What? Um, yes. My overflowing charm seems to have reached Hifumi. I'm Hifumi Togo. Playing Shogi by yourself. I'm doing some research, so experimenting with new tactics is best to do alone in a place like this. I don't suppose that sounds terribly plausible to someone who doesn't play. Has her character thing changed? For some reason, I feel like she looks different. Am I wrong? Um, ah, Tuesday and Saturday, okay. Uh, Hifumi Togo seems to be taking a very tactical approach to Shogi. I feel like I can learn some tactics for the Phantom Thieves. I should ask her if she'll teach me. Yes? Aw, thank you, Maddie. Thanks for you? joining us and donating. Uh, I said that weird. Thank you for joining us and donating. Can I help you? Can you teach me, Shogi? Be my teacher. Huh? Has her look changed? Something about her looks more mature. I thought she was dressed like a hot, like a school kid, like the uniform. Is it maybe it's because it's summer? It's cut. I probably because it's summer. She wouldn't be dressed up as a school kid in the summer. You um, don't need to. You necess don't necessarily oh. have to learn from me, you know. There are other options, such as playing online. Mm -hmm. Sorry, I just can't. Why? Well then. We can date her too, can't we? Maybe we'll do that. I like her too. Um. Apparently quiet, serious nerds are my type. So, you like Shogi? Huh? Oh, um. Thank you very much. Um. Okay, just a quick game then. 20 seconds per move, if that's all right with you. Oh. Ah, uh, he's oh, just sorry. gonna pretend? Boy, oh boy, that's gonna be fun. So this is your skill level, huh? She's like, wow, you suck. The dragon which governs the blue sky has fallen into my hands. How do you intend to survive this? Ah! Uh. Check. <laughs> it's checkmate, no matter how you look at it. Please concede. To concede is an act of admitting that you have lost with grace. If you aspire to become a shogi player, I recommend that you take your oh, study of the game to heart. Be safe. See y'all later. Thank you for playing. Well then, that will be all for today. If it's all right with you, may I request another match sometime? Yay! I feel a gambler's spirit emanating from you. Let's be friends. Which is strange, since your style of play is that of a complete novice. Huh? Oh, I'm sorry. However, I will instruct you under one condition. You become my playing partner 
so that I can research new moves. Is that agreeable? Sounds good to me. Thank you very much. Well then, it's a deal. I'll teach you how to play, and you'll assist me with my new hey, moves. Hey, Neil, welcome. All right, I made a new friend. And now they're gonna do that whole, ah, uh, so I heard you had a friend that played Shogi. I love that every time it jumps to the future. I, it's part of the, like, intensity and the remembering that this is all a flashback thing, but it's I like, that quite advanced <laughs> extrapolate that further, and that it would be like arts. every time you made a new friend. So, you must have known someone who worked at the Starbucks. <laughs> I don't know. And yours weren't by the wit of an amateur. You had a professional who regularly deals with such tactics. <sighs> Yes, I did you volunteer to become her show, is, show, show G sub. I am that it shall become the wings of Rebecca with the birth the of the star. star. Nice. All right. Yay, we can swap characters out. Yes. Thank you, Hifumi. My hero. Okay, let's end here for today. Thank you for today. Before you head home, would you like to change IDs? There's no obligation. Thank you, all right then. There went through. I'll let you know if I come up with any new strategies. Yay! We made a friend. <sighs> Going to your place tomorrow. I'll be on standby at the hideout. There's a book I want to read, and the dorm's so hot I can't stand it. How about joining me? Yeah! He's pretty low-level friend, so... As long as there's nobody else we need to hang out with. cries of joy. I'm talking about the sudden burst of posts we got on the fan site. It must be because of how popular the fan phantom thieves are. Why are you talking about it like you're not involved? <laughs> Let me tell you about the most interesting thing I've found. Indiscriminate acts of violence in Shibuya. Pretty scary, huh? I can't find much more than that, though. All the posts mention rumors they heard in the underground mall in Shibuya, but nothing else. It's not super reliable. It'd be good if we could find out more about the rumors, but my presence is limited to the web. You might want to learn more on your own. Hey, Tin Tins, welcome! Hey. Alright, let's see here. Greetings, Senpai. Just thinking of inviting you out. Yes, you are important! We shall hang out with you immediately. Sorry, Yusuke! <laughs> of living creatures just fascinating. Ah, no! I'm born to their taste! Right. Their will to survive shines through their every move. If I only could perform like this. Speaking of performances, I really want to see the dolphin show. I might get some inspiration from watching an elegant dolphin moving in perfect sync with its trainer. And there's a sea lion show, too. Well, what do you want to do? I'd rather see dolphins. Sea lions. See both, and they're not at the same time. I see. Why limit ourselves to just one? Of course! Oh, she loved it! I too love hanging out with all the sea creatures. I have a present for you. It was at the gift shop, and I couldn't resist. I got a sea slug! Ha! Nice. I think that this can go is... in my bedroom. Your victims can verify you. I don't think that counts, Phil. I think, uh. 
think you're backing yourself into a corner there, buddy. Man, it's hot. Alright. Nope. Nobody is used to this. Nope. Alright. Uh, when do we hang out with the politician? We have to do some things to get the politician. Hello, Nyan Kirby. Um. Let me see. Did we already unlock him? What's the? Where's the button? That's the button. Politician guy. Man of the people. We got him. Um, but we can only hang out with him what? Sundays? I think he's Sunday. So today we could go unlock what's her face. Hello, Zelda Lena, welcome. Alright, why don't we unlock what's her face? And go from there. It's way too hot. I remember you, you had an abnormal destiny. Take a seat. <laughs> Change your fate. Mm. All right, well, I'll buy one. Thank you very much, here you go. Yay. It's the mm -hmm. smart thing to do, considering it's the only way to avoid misfortune. It's already charged with a happiness aura, so you'll feel the effects right away. Don't forget to recharge it with moonlight every three days. Please stop by again and let me know how your fate changed. Well, then. Goodbye! Ah, you're back. Got to close up shop, but I forgot to turn the stove off. I guess you start forgetting things more the older you get. Last time we went to the fortune cello, the chief, chief won the lottery. I wonder what kind of luck we'll have this time around. It should be awesome, right? I mean, we paid 100,000 yen for this holy... Ow, what the heck? Why don't you keep this thing a little cleaner? I can't live... Be comfortable with all this gravel at the bottom of the... Wait, Ren, I have a bad feeling. Hey. Do you mind looking over the shop while I... For real? Stone shattered! It's gotten into you. This Whoa. tastes salty. The holy stone is just salt. Ren, what's going on? I'm just a bit salty. You're salty. That reminds me, I was about to head out and grab some salt for the shop. I'll be back in a bit. Hmm. I think this is technically rock salt. I've seen the chief grinding some up before. In that case, maybe the holy stone's supposed to help you get better at cooking. That didn't make any sense. But maybe if your cooking improves, your fate will change? I guess it doesn't make sense, huh? No so it really way. was just a phony stone in the end. Fortune Teller's name was Chahaya, right? She clearly has some kind of mystical power, but this is unacceptable. Hey. We need to go complain to her. This one's a bit difficult. There have been some strange happenings in the back alley off Shibuya's central street. Apparently people have been finding dead or hurt cats! No! Gandalf, cover your ears! Happens so often people think someone's abusing them. That's unforgivable! Only the scum of the earth would take out their aggression on weak, innocent animals. There is only so much available to get. Investigate yourself, blah blah blah. Yeah, salt's considered a holy thing in some religions, but, uh, clearly it was not a stone, you know. Eh, it's not exactly what she promised. Let's go see how close we are to leveling him up. Hey, pal, how you doing? What's up? Okay. Hey. I won't deepen yet. Not just yet, I think. Oh, Let's see. Kodo, Ryuji. Oh, Takemi will go up, but we got to do that one in the evening, right? Uh, so, I guess right now we'll start with quests, maybe? Where's my... Justice for cats. 
Central Street Convenience Store. Central Street. Hello, everyone. Tell me about cats. Okay, hackers. Okay, weird. Nope, don't like y'all. Somebody outside? Well, that's just those two losers. Maybe back here. No? Hello? Maybe that rest of the place? That's the discount store. Hmm. Maybe it's the time of day. Maybe I need to come back at night. What was the other one? I mean, someone's been attacking people. Investigate the underground mall. Should you the bar? So the bar, the mall. Have you read Komi San KK? I have not. Um, what have I been reading right now? Right now I'm reading something called uh crap, what's it called? The Master Being a Master is Hard or something. Ha! <laughs> it's not called that. Um guy is re in, uh, reborn inside of the the body of a teacher. Uh, reincarnated. Normal guy from our world uh, wakes up in the body of a teacher of a guy that in the book he was reading was a horrible teacher and uh, ruined his life and so he killed him. And of course the guy's like, well I gotta live a better life and uh, make sure he doesn't kill me this time. Unfortunately uh, he doesn't know that the student also has been reincarnated and remembers his past life. So, uh, he's actually already kind of pissed off, but anyway, they end up figuring it out. It's kind of short, comparatively, but, uh, it's interesting. I'm having fun with it. This is the underground mall? This is cool. Oh, you're right! You have to work at the convenience store for the cat thing. Okay. Now let's poke around the underground mall. Thank you for stopping in. Refrain from touching the merchandise. No, thank you. Uh, yeah, it's very much like scum saving system is a very popular trope. Like the idea of uh, being reborn in the body of the villain character seems to be very popular, wherein the villain falls for the hero and they're not actually bad this time. the The difference in this story seems to be the fact that the hero remembers the person being a villain, and is really confused about the fact that they are no longer a villain. That's the twist in this particular instance. Uh, it's been fun to read. It's got a mystery kind of going on where the guy that read the book doesn't really remember why the dude was a villain, hey. and there's stuff going on in the background. It's interesting. I like it. Maybe I have to work down here, too. Wasn't there something about having to work at a florist, maybe? I get a job? Ah, oh, the eternal question, how do I get a job? I think it's these things, right? Where are they? What are your thoughts? Uh, triple seven. Okay, that's where we need to work. Hmm. Fly! Okay. All 
Alright, give me that jump. Okay. I guess we'll start with that one and go from there. Now, let us go to Burger Town. Burger Time. Burger Place. Oh, will it let me just work at the job right now? Like I just applied and now I can work here? That's convenient, I suppose. Hey! Alright. What do you I want will to go do? to work! Are you? Ah, just like the old days. Oh god, at least I never had to wear that! You applied for the job, right? We'll be asking you to the work to register. Please watch your co-workers to learn the ropes. Man, I would have loved to have watched my co-workers to learn the ropes rather than just being told to go to the cash register and then do it. And then that was it. Literally at the pizza place I worked at, they just pointed me at it and said, go figure it out, you know? And gave me like 10 minutes to kind of poke and prod at the numbers and figure it out. Ugh. Moose Target actually taught you what you were doing. Alright. I appreciate it. Man, you and I have different ideas of sexy, Phil. Wow. Look at that service. <sighs> have a lot of customers today. Okay, nice I'm to Nami Shibuya. I guess I'm your senpai. Did you want watching me give you an idea of what to do? <laughs> How promising. I'll expect great things of you. Let me give you so... one pointer. Remember where the barcodes are. That will save you a ton of time. How about I test you? Cow's milk. Can you tell me where the barcode is? That's right. It's indeed next to the company logo. <laughs> Didn't mean to act like a big shot, but it's little bits of knowledge that help you keep your cool. Good work Sorry today. Sorry to keep you. I know you're tired. Hey! Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. I did things. Yes, and I do my cool point up the glasses thing. Uh, well, let's go back. home. Where would you want to be reincarnated mm. to? Honestly? Mm, Elf in the Lord of the Rings. Maybe. At certain points. Because it's just so big and pretty and empty. I would just wander around, and I'm an elf, so I don't need, like, food, or water, or sleep. And I can just wander around in the pretty, pretty places. And do that forever, I guess. <laughs> That's one idea. Uh, you're back. Just me or Ben Ben, a ton of info leaks. Uh, blah, 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 there's stuff, the hate we're getting is insane, people treat this like it's our fault. Uh, not yet. I need time. We're gonna keep trying. We do what we can. Alright. Big lead. Uh, you wanna hear about it right now? Sure. We can hang out with him. It's been a while since we've talked to him. Hello, kitty. Hey! I have some great info for you. Mishima's such a dork. Um, Next target for the Phantom Thieves. This one's massive. Of course, we've got a huge target on our hands. This is the guy. He's a handsome young actor who's been rapidly gaining popularity lately. He's great at acting, has solid conversational skills, been in all sorts of commercials. If you manage to change his heart, everyone will have to start paying attention to the Phantom Thieves. He's gotta be doing shady stuff, I know it. No, I'm not saying that out of jealousy. I heard a rumor that a famous idol fell into his clutches. You need to act on behalf of her fans. Uh-huh. I am calm, and thinking about it from my calm standpoint, I believe you guys can benefit from changing his heart. I mean, this would be the best publicity possible for you guys. Pretty good tactic, huh? Aren't I an amazing producer? Just you wait. I'm gonna put the Phantom Thieves on the map. You'll be practically swimming in requests. Oh, this little idiot. Mishima's motivation seems to be growing stronger. Sword. Alright. We will now be earning more EXP. Thank you. 
I'm the producer for the famous Phantom Thieves. I'm not boring. I'm not a zero. This kid is totally going through some, uh, shit. I mean, he was just, like, physically and emotionally abused for new who knows how long from that school, like, teacher, whatever. And his parents knew about it and just let it happen. This poor kid has no support system. All right. I just sent you the actor's data. Don't worry, this request will boost your popularity guaranteed. After all, I'm the only reason you guys have gotten this far, right? Is that right? No, I think no. you mean yes, that's right. Ugh, you just don't know all the stuff I do for you guys. Phantom Thieves' success is thanks to me, and the Phantom Thieves are changing the world. That means I'm responsible for those changes. That means Damn I'm it. not a zero. Poor boy. Uh, check the info, I'll let you know once I found more details. See you around. <sighs> I've seen more people fling hate at Mishima solely because of what he was forced to do at the start of the game than I've seen give it to Akechi. Of course, because Akechi's like brooding handsome boy and Mishima's awkward dork. Poor Mishima gets so much more hate. And the big difference, I think, is, as a character, he has annoying- his- his trauma shows up as annoying character traits. And Akechi shows up as traits that we find interesting, like his brooding aspect and his double-faced, you know, that's more interesting than annoying teenage boy. But an annoying teenage boy is sar so far more likely to just exist as a- an example of trauma in the world, you know? Are you still awake? I'm worried what's gonna happen and can't fall asleep. Right now, all we can do is pray and wait. Wanna go pray at a shrine together? Yeah, we'll go to Meiji Shrine. Meiji? Meiji. I think it's Meiji. Meiji Shrine. Meiji. That sounds like Wedgie. Wedgie Shrine! No. Meiji Shrine. Pray your heart out. Let's go. All right. people will pray before filming movies so it'll go smoothly. Should we try praying to the gods too? It could be about us. For the Phantom Thieves? Yeah, for the future of the Phantom Thieves. Oh, but I don't really know how to pray properly. What should I do? Maybe I'll ask someone. You gotta wash your hands and mouth. You gotta clap. Like once? Clap once or twice? You gotta clap to get the gods' attention. Then you bow and you, you pray your thought. And I think you, like, leave offerings, possibly, afterward. I'm sure there's more variations and more stuff, but I remember the clapping to get the attention of the god is a big one. You want to bow out of respect and say... And you gotta clean your mouth and your hand. You gotta be clean. You gotta purify yourself. It's a doctor lady! Is that so? What a surprise seeing you in a place like this. Are you on a date? Such an odd location for someone your age. We're friends. Meiji. 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 I'm gonna look it up. I was saying Meiji because I remember how it was said in the TV show once, but that's not to say that this, um, you know, American dubbed TV show could not have said it wrong. Let's see. Me -da 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 pronunciation. Okay, say it. Meiji. You're right! Meiji! Meiji. Meiji. So the J-I is more of a G-E in our sound. So Meiji. 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 Alright. Uh, shake a rope or a bell? Yeah, I think, uh, the, that's a variation on the get the god's attention thing. Probably if the shrine has a bell, you'd ring the bell, and if not, you'd clap your hands. Uh, not that I care. Is this someone you know? Don't worry about me, I don't intend to intrude. Oh. I assume you're here for college entrance exams. You mentioned you had them before. Shake the bell twice and put in your offering, then bow twice, clap twice, and bow once again. Okay, so this involves all of it. Uh, whoops, wasn't that what you wanted to ask? Really hope to sell. Thanks, Doc. 
sure. Although you may want to use this time to actually study instead of praying. Exams? Wait, I think I recognized her. Right. That's the doctor who gets us our medicine. Wait, you've been here the whole time? How rude. I'm here to present. What's this about praying for college entrance exams? Yep. We asked earlier if she could get us some super stimulants to help us study. I, ah, I see. see. Wouldn't the gods be mad to get a visit from a cheater? Let's get back. So you're saying a good way to pray to the gods is to shout, Hey, asshole, eyes on me before brushing my teeth and burning some stuff? Phil. Go ahead, do that, Phil. In a public place. Get your ass beat. Man, it's <laughs> nah, I don't know. <laughs> that would be so funny, though, if you did do that in a public church or something, and somebody just, what the f- <laughs> I laugh at Phil's possible suffering. A <gasps> uh, place I'd like to show you. I'm fond of it. Would be able to relax at least. Uh, would you join me? Yes! I shall join you! Waiting up in Kichi Joji. Kichi Joji. God, he always looks like he's part of the Avengers. This is it. It's a rather nice place quite an apology for that. It's not quite an apology for that little incident back at the cafe, but rest assured we're safe here. I'm a regular. It's nice to take some time off when we can, don't you think? What kind of place is this? It's just a jazz club. You get to hear some great performers here. I'm glad you're so taken with it. It's safe to assume you've visited places like this before. Very in any well. case, let's head Let in. Let us go. What a nerd. His favorite place is a jazz club. What will you do? Why don't we get some drinks? Any recommendations? Nothing in particular, but if you don't mind me choosing, I'll put in a random order. You don't have any soft drinks you actively dislike, yes? I just let my date pick for me. This is totally a date. Also, I love his look. Thanks for waiting, here's your order. We have a special performance today, so I hope you enjoy it. Looks like it's starting. Let's sit back and enjoy the show. I enjoyed listening to music with a catchy. How relaxing. I really do like coming here. It's a great place. Glad to hear you say that. Work and obligations take me to quite a few restaurants and cafes, but this place is a little more special to me. I guess you could call it my go-to place. Do you have anywhere like that? Uh, is that so? Hmm. Now I'm intrigued. You should show me the place sometime. Really? So you came to Tokyo on your own, and now you live in a cafe loft. Impressive. It's like something out of a story. Though I have to say I'm envious. You must be quite well stocked on coffee and curry. I live alone myself, but I rarely have the time to cook my own meals. That reminds me, do you cook? Pretty frequently? That's Very impressive. impressive. I don't have much experience myself. Even my efforts in cooking class have been underwhelming. In particular, an attempt to fillet a fish went poorly. I usually come here when I need some time to really think on my own, so chatting with you is really quite refreshing. You know, Speaking you're the first which... person I've ever brought here. That's because I'm your only friend. It's not like I was keeping it from anyone, but I suppose it goes to show we do have some strange connection. It's called friendship. <laughs> you just don't understand it yet. Oh, precious boy. All right. He's so, so sad and dumb. It's gotten late. We should probably be going. Goodbye. Oh, a catchy. I should recognize the singer? Is she a specific character? It's me. Are you good to talk right now? Wasn't the music today wonderful? Live bands always have a certain power to their music. Certainly the point of jazz is all those jam sessions. A sea of improvisation, both complex and organic. As each player incorporates their own flares and 
flavors, a natural melody is born from chaos. There's something about that strange, erratic synchronicity. It's a euphoria like when I managed to solve a case. I suppose so. Perhaps I'm still ringing with the energy of the last performance. Oh, I didn't mean... I meant... Uh, I was trying to say... Ah, damn it. I made him upset. I'm sure you'll eventually understand. Jazz is a deep and complex kind of music. It's on the audience to refine their taste to the point they can appreciate all the nuances. Ah, I shall let you go. Somehow I always end up talking more than usual when it's new. Expect another invitation soon. For now, please excuse me. in the hospital. We talked about stuff while I was there. That just made me think even more what I, I wanted to talk about. Do you think you could listen to what I have to say? Aww. Yo. Precious baby. Okay. Alright. Way too hot. Well then. Okay. Hello. I have a favorite mask. It's not really a gymnastics thing, would you mind coming on a shopping trip? Yes! Let us do this. Thank you, Resend. Thank you. Sorry, my phone seems to be acting up. I think I'm good now. About the place. It's in Kishijoji, you know it. I'll send the location of the shop, I'll be waiting. I've never played Primal. I've heard of it. Senpai? Uh, sorry for dragging you out here. I need a new pair of glasses. I've been wanting to come here for a while, but never had the chance. You have bad eyesight. A little. I usually wear my contacts, though. But I'm not looking for a pair for me. I was hoping to find a good gift for my dad. You know, it seemed like a real glasses buff, so I wanted to get your advice. Could you try on a couple pairs for me? I'd like to get some visual reference. Thanks so much. Thank you so much. Let's see. How about this? I Those think that's really good. work for you. So cool. What do you think? Pretty modern. I know it's so fashionable and it's good to help your vision too. This could be a good one. Hmm. Do they suit your dad though? Right. Maybe a little too hip for my dad. But your input's been really helpful. Would you mind looking around a bit longer? I'm this is kind of fun. Let's pick up the pace. No, don't I like see. it. You look like a salesman, but it doesn't feel right somehow. Ah! <laughs> Those leave an impression. Heck, people might remember the glasses and nothing else. That's definitely true. You're I like a star it. right out of Hollywood. But if my dad wore them, he might look a little shady. This Why are those even here? I kind of want a pair. Sorry, I can't decide. A lot of them are good, but none of them have really clinched it for me yet. Trust your instincts. You know, you're right. I'm the one who has to make the call. I'm going in with a gut feeling, but I'll pick this pair. I don't know how to describe it, but it seems perfect for my dad. I'm sure he'll love it. That That's what sense. my gut tells me. A little weird to shop for prescription glasses with Thank someone that's not there, but here. okay. Thanks for coming with me. I ended up with a great present, all thanks to you. Not a problem at all. Well, I've still got to make it up to you. Let's go practice at Ino Kashira Park. Wow. If I'm being honest, trying to pick out glasses was really setting off my anxiety. All I could think of was what would happen if I couldn't choose or chose wrong. I mean, I already failed in gymnastics and my cooking turned out bad too. After cracking under pressure so many times, I kind of figured I'd ruin everything again. The more I thought about it, the more empty I felt. Like I wasn't even me anymore. That's your slump talking. Yeah, but... I think Senpai? I'm starting to understand what my coach was telling me. It's easy to say you're in a slump and write yourself off. But maybe finding out who I really am is also about finding new depths to myself. It does make me feel a little down, but at the same time, I feel like I'm closer to getting my confidence back. 
And having your support makes me even more determined to make that happen. This is strange. I don't know if I should be feeling like this. I want to give it my best performance, but it's like I'd be doing it for you as much as for myself or something like that. I'm still working on myself, but I hope we can keep helping each other, too. No. Alright, one more and we're done! Alright. Use your grappling hook. Oh, cool! Attack hook! I've got my attack hook. We should get to training. Maybe we can try some intermediate level exercises today. All right. All right. I'll be heading home now. Hello, I'm I'm a Mia Senpai. Are you able to talk right now? I already gave my dad the glasses, and it suits him better than I imagined. He was so happy. Glad to hear that. Thank you. I feel like this helped me to be a little more confident, and thanks to you, I feel like my gymnastics are going to go better now. I'm sick of wasting my time worrying. Whatever I'm up against, I'm just gonna give it my best shot. You go, girl. Actions always speak louder than words, right? I'll prove I'm not all talk. I'd better go. I hope we can talk again later. Yeah, Kasumi is adorable. Man, it's hot. Alright. Well then. The usual spot. Alright, let's help out. We haven't hung out with the politician guy. Not much. Everyone. Passing on the societal ills we've created to the next generation is not right. It will take time to solve the problem. However, we must start by making small changes. I you. hope you gleaned something useful from today's speech. Regardless of the audience size, you must convey your thoughts as if you're talking one-on-one. -on -one. By the way, I forgot to ask you last time we spoke. Why do you want to become a politician? Ambitious mm -hmm. indeed, if a little ambiguous. I'm sure you'll iron out the details as you go along. May I ask one more question? What kind of politician do you want to be? Don't ever forget that. Although what's important is what lies within. Allow me right. to give you some advice. If you aspire to get into politics, you must possess a central philosophy. What is it you want to accomplish? That is the foundation of a great speech. You'd do well to remember that. I'm glad. By the way, my philosophy is never yeah. give up until your voice is heard. To get your message across, be tenacious in conveying your thoughts to the audience. Have a firm point of view and communicate it clearly. The first rule of negotiating. <laughs> you have me reliving the fighting spirit I had when I first became a politician. Yay! Get the hell out of here, no good Tora. Mm. Tora? They're right, I am no good. You know, that man has tiny feet. Seriously, look at his feet compared to my character's feet. He has tiny feet. My apologies were done for the day. Or maybe I just have big feet. I shall ask you again another time. I wanted to thank you for today. I'm sorry you had to see me acting like a coward right after I gave you that self-important lecture, but I'm quite a stubborn individual myself. I hope today's incident was at least a good example of what not to do, but what do you think? Did you take anything useful from it? Ah, uh, that's a relief. I have to say, it was almost nostalgic for me. It reminded me of my early days. I hope our talks from now on will keep giving you the direction you need. I hope to see you again soon. Goodbye. Man, I am so freaking popular. <sighs> I'll be at standby at the hideout. Uh, I found something interesting. A DVD that talks about paintings from the world. Okay. All right. Yep. All right, we're gonna have to take a quick break because I am starving. 
I'm gonna go make a sandwich and then we shall continue. So, hey. I will be right back. I'll just add this.
waited a little too long. I got a headache. Ah, but it'll go away once I eat. I have uh, low iron levels and I ran a bunch of errands today and didn't eat my normal food. My body's uh, not happy about it. Crunchy peanut butter is so much better. I like that crunch. I gotta have my crunch. Mm. Mm. Gandalf is, of course, here and watching my sandwich. Okay. Oh, yeah. Alright, now we can decorate my room a little bit. Oh, I forgot I had a fountain. Oh, it's cute! Hmm. Hmm. I don't know that I just need a chocolate fountain. I think we should remove that. story short, uh, if your body doesn't have enough iron, your body doesn't get enough oxygen, and your brain doesn't like that, and once I get some iron in my system, I'll be better. The problem is I just didn't eat as well when I was out today. We'll just have to wait for now. All right, let's talk. spinach and rusty nail uh, sandwich. Well, this sandwich does have spinach on it. I did not think about the rusty nails. You know what she did? Laughed. She couldn't stop talking about how tough she thought Mika sounded. Honestly, though, it was kind of refreshing. I'm not even mad anymore. I guess you really just need someone to laugh at you if you want to feel better. If it's a friend, yeah. You're probably right about that. If it was a random person, it made me even angrier if it was a random person. Anyway, even though I'm trying to strengthen my heart, she's the strong one here. Hey. I went to one of her rehab sessions the other day. She said she wanted me to be there. I agreed without thinking much of it, but it ended up being pretty overwhelming. Yeah, it was a lot tougher than I'd ever imagined. It was horrible. She was dripping with sweat, teeth clenched, clearly in a lot of pain. Apparently, she can't even move her le her feet. She said it was it feels like her legs are filled with sand. But she dragged them along, legs swollen with blood. I wanted to make her stop. <laughs> By the time it was over, she was in tears. It was really tough on her. She said she wanted to give up. And that's why she asked me to come, to keep her motivated. The whole time, she was complaining about things in ways she normally never would. But even with that, she finished the session. Mm -hmm. I don't know why I'm crying. Is it because I'm weak? It's because you're kind. You're wrong. Even through all that pain, I thought Shiho was so cool, beautiful even. Despite all her complaining, she still tried incredibly hard. Strength is more than just not getting phased. It's the power to fight through adversity. Hmm. I was thinking, what can I do to help Shiho? 
show her your own strength. Yeah. I'll do just that. I'm gonna give it my all. Mm-hmm. You help me see things clearly. What I should do, the true meaning of strength. Thank Thanks. you for that. I sensed a heightened motivation from on. I sense a heightened motivation from a cat. A motivation to steal my sandwich. You only love me for my right. sandwich. Oh, I missed whatever that was. Oh, Bye. well. See you around. It's me. Thanks for earlier. I feel better now that I got to talk to you. I'm going to try my best to help Shio out in my own way. Maybe our relationship won't be exactly the way it was before. But now that I saw her crying, I know I'll find something to do for her. I'll cheer you on. Thanks. I can't let her leave me behind. Watch me. One day I'll be cool and strong just like Shiho. You already are. You both are. I feel great now that I got everything off my chest. You're such a great listener, Ren. <laughs> just another pest. Look at this. Literally. Let me see if I can get the camera without disturbing him. That's mine! Stop that! You stop it. You go away. You shoo. Ren. You're bad. That's mommy's dinner. I don't steal your dinner. What are you gonna do with this? It's not for you. You can't have it. No. Go away. You bad. You bad. <laughs> Shogi practice. All right. It's Monday. Why not? What a downpour. All right, let's hang out. I look forward to it. I'll start. Vanguard of my Togo kingdom, go forth to the front lines, trample upon them all. You think to protect yourself with that paltry defense. Ha ha ha, useless. Awaken, dragon, that your shadowy hellfire consume them all, dark inferno rook. Man, shogi and games like chess and stuff would be so much better this way. With an incompetent king, a soldier cannot show his true bravery. Time for you to suffer. At last, everything is in place. My right hand trembles as I release my full power. I summon forth the forbidden move that shall bring your end. Exodia! No, I mean... <laughs> Ultimate Excalibur attack. Check. I did it again. It's an embarrassing habit I have. During a match, I tend to get very aggressive. It's as if I assume the role of a queen of a kingdom. That's interesting. You're a strange one. Mm -hmm. My father had me do image training exercise when I was younger to help me learn the rules. I began to view the shogi board as if it were my own kingdom. I had fun coming up with stories and strategies for my, uh, subjects, however. I've heard that people make fun of me on the internet. Who cares about the internet? They're boring! Mm -hmm. People think I'm weird or an otaku or crazy? I can't blame them. Certainly I think I'm weird, too. Don't worry about them. They're boring! Yes. Your positivity is a welcome relief. I may be able to learn more from our matches than I thought. Can't get it now. Ha! Ha! <laughs> Don't try and be cute now. You were trying to eat my dinner. You were stealing food right out of my mouth. All right. All right. 
right. And Otaku, that's like a um, super big anime nerd or like nerd of Japanese culture. Uh, in the West, it's kind of taken on like a badge of honor, but in Japan, it's typically used as an insult. Oh, something I wanted to mention. Do you read weekly magazines? Well, I'm doing a photo shoot for one. You're quite perceptive. I thought you'd be surprised if you saw it on the newsstand, so I wanted to let you know beforehand. In all honesty, I'm reluctant to do it. But if I can draw more attention to Shogi, maybe the sport will become more popular. That's how I'm justifying it to myself. I have an interview scheduled for tonight as well, so let's end here for today. I feel like playing has... Oh, that makes sense. She was originally gonna have uh, the queen role and then Makoto took it over. They're kind of similar. Until next time. Ooh, there was. Oh man, I want to look up her what her rebel outfit was gonna look like. Way too hot. Okay. Let's go to work. Uh, I guess I can't do it that way. Let's see. Uh, I can only do that one at night. I guess I can do Yusuke. I'd rather have Yusuke go up, I guess. I think he's in the walkway. Yeah, it's kind of like Weeaboo. Yeah, that's true. Hmm. By the way. All right, let's hang out. <laughs> uh, it's on display. Want to come see it with me? Let's go, Yusuke. <laughs> Now we can go to the museum. Now we can steal Gandalf. Stolen. Indeed. I stole him. Hello. Look at all the pretty art, kitty. Say, I hate this. Why do you do this, mother? In addition to the ex exhibition aspect of the show, there's also an evaluation portion. I believe my piece truly stands out among the sea of art here. Yet nobody's come to see it. Perhaps they are afraid of the truth held within that they dare not take a closer look. Honestly, I really like his piece. I think it looks cool. What is this supposed to be? There's a dark, almost sinister aura emanating from it. The title is Desire. I see no desire here. I understand now. This area is for students. The artist likely decided to paint this on a whim. Indeed, there is neither elegance nor emotion in this piece. Come, dear. There are much more detailed paintings over here. Pretty sure that's not how, like, the average person <laughs> looks at art, but yeah. There's no need to worry. I am not bothered in the slightest. There is nothing more than the drivel of unrefined commoners. I didn't pay any mind to them. As long as those who are in the know understand my work, I will be happy. This is, hmm, a knowledgeable patron has arrived. Hmm, I would like your opinion, sir. What are your thoughts on this piece? I can see quite clearly why I was accepted into the exhibition. The technique is excellent. However, the composition as a whole is mediocre at best. How dare you? Ah, are you the artist? The title is listed as Desire, but the idea is quite overused. Some may even call it stale. If you want to paint an abstract work with an old theme, you must inject individuality into it. What? Take another look. Try to remove yourself from the artist's bias. The brush strokes are splendid given your age, but does this painting really tell you anything? It's empty, devoid of meaning. I suggest you take a more critical eye to your work in the future if you truly want to progress as an artist. My work is empty? Indeed. Why? Why? I put my heart and soul into the piece, captured the essence of desire. It was supposed to lay bare the reality of the world. Perhaps he was right. It may be empty after all. The colors, the brush strokes, they do not convey the true meaning of desire, only my conception of it. I haven't des captured desire, desire has captured me. 
How could this be? How could I have fooled myself into believing otherwise? Oh, Yusuke. It is as though I have been forsaken by the gods of art! This grave mistake shall be the end for me. This is just the beginning. Calm down. Do not patronize me. I have no future in this field. Without... What is going to happen to me now? Without art, what will remain of my being? Stand up, Yusuke, please. We're in a public place. What? I, I see. see. I must stand up. Both literally and figuratively. Failure and art go hand in hand. I cannot simply give up now. This dork. I love him. Still, being criticized by someone with such a keen eye is truly painful. Okay. But that is all the more reason I must break out of my slump. I must prove my ability to him. That's the spirit. I will start by painting. After that, I will paint. Beyond which, I shall paint even more. That is the only way I will learn to capture the essence of emotion. After all, you can only accomplish so much in using logic to analyze the contents of the heart. I will hope you will allow me to continue my skill card services as well, Ren. I shall conquer this! Alright. Alrighty. Now then, let us head home. I wish to start anew. A slump, huh? I love you, Ske. Ah, dork. Bren, I apologize for causing a scene earlier. That one gentleman's critique made me fully realize what I've been lacking. Now my path is clear. I will simply keep on drawing. I'm going to have ten pieces finished by the end of today. That is a spirit. Ha! Anything I should be doing more. I'll do anything to escape this slump. With your support, I was able to pick myself up rather quickly. I hope this doesn't discourage you from joining me again. I will get past this. Sorry for taking up so much of your time. We'll meet again soon. Man, it's hot. Another scorcher. All right. It's Tuesday. We can hang out with What's-His-Face. You want to do training today? I want to try something different. All right. Jeez. Okay, Dad. <sighs> Finish eating and send a reply when we go upstairs. <laughs> oh, he's such a dad. I love it. All right. Let's go see her. We're gonna go train at the batting cages. Oh boy. Probably didn't expect to be meeting me at the batting center, huh? I thought so, but I'm glad you decided to humor me. Batting helps train your reflexes and dynamic vision. It also strengthens your stance. Those are important elements in gymnastics, too. It's all pretty plausible, right? Actually, I just wanted to come here. Honestly, I wanted you to see me hit a home run. 
remembered something from when I was little. My father used to take me to the batting cages a lot. The other kids were scared of getting hit by the baseballs, but I just loved swinging the bat around. Every time I hit one, I kept thinking, it doesn't matter how fast they are, I'll slam them into orbit. I thought if I tried to put myself back in that headspace, I could get some ideas on how to get my boldness back. Good work, right? Good idea. Yes. I don't know. Hello. Alright. What are you doing here? Uh, give me some credit cards. But I wanted to come oh. and be like Waluigi and say, Wah! You dork. What? Alright. Uh, you bring Hello. that down to her. Because of Wah! Dork. <laughs> Were they always this fast? I'll get the next one. Come on, baby girl. Okay, for one. Oh, baby girl, no. Baby girl, no, what are you doing? This is not, no. As a former baseball player, <laughs> behind your head, elbows below your chin, not like this. <laughs> She's got it like above her head. Like, you're not, that's nothing. Baby, that is nothing. What's the next one? No I more warm ups. From now on, it's gonna be 100% home runs. Oh, girl. Oh, no. I'm I knew sorry. I was rusty, but I didn't expect to miss all of them. I never see the ball coming, and I keep flinching. I didn't think my slump was hitting me this hard. Senpai, you're right. I'll give it one more shot. Oh, no, no. Don't, no. Stay calm. Don't be scared. Eyes on the ball. Here I go. Come on. Ah. She's an athlete, she knows what she's doing. No, she does not. You have no, okay, the way that it, <laughs> she, cause the, the reason you have it here is so you can get your shoulders into it and get that motion. You can't do anything with, you can't move your shoulders like that. Yeah, that is a good, I, that's a good stance for hitting somebody, not a ball. We did oh, it. I did it, senpai, I hit the ball. Congratulations. I'd never have done it without your encouragement, senpai. Till now, I've only been working for myself. I was so desperate to make a good impression. But since I started hanging out with you, I started feeling like I wanted to live up to your expectations, and the feelings helped me feel so much stronger. I'd forgotten how it felt to work that hard on someone else's behalf. Yes. Of course. Ever since I met you, I've discovered so many things about myself, but now I feel like I'm closer than ever to getting my confidence back. Please, All right, I've been feeling a lot more limber and energized lately, too. I'm not totally back to normal yet, but even my grades have been going back up. Nicely done. I Thank still need to much. show you what I can do. Next time, you won't have to watch me fumbling with a bat. I'll show you an all-new full-power gymnastics routine. Yay! I am thou. We've done it! Thou art I. Thou hast birthed a bond clad in the heart's strength. This union, born and embraced by will unyielding, shall become the balefire that lights thy path. Thou hast gained a glimpse of the faith's truth, granting thee further power to tread the abyss. Yeah! All right. Anyway, we've still got a lot to hit. I think it's your turn. Give it all the guts you've got. Smash it into outer space. Good Thanks effort. for today. Amamiya, I'm in, Amamiya, Senpai. Thank you so much for coming with me today. I haven't swung a bat in a while. My arms still feel kind of weird. Is that because you were holding them like that? I can't get over that. I played baseball for like three years. I've never seen anyone hold it like that. I bet you it was something to do with animation. Like the difficulty of having her arms in that position. I was kind of hoping to knock it out with a clang, but I'm happy I managed to hit the ball. It's nice to dip into sports aside from gymnastics. Was there anything else you wanted to try, Senpai? Swimming, that was my jam. 
That's a great full body exercise, good for a well-balanced muscle tone. And since it's not as stressful on your bones and joints, it enhances your cardiopulmonary functions as well. That's why my mom is getting a pool. I tell y'all that? They're building it in March. Perhaps we can go next time. Or wait, do I even own a swimsuit? I don't think I have anything other than leotards. I have a request for you. May I ask you to join me for more things from now on? When I'm with you, I feel more capable. Whenever you want to go train again or hang out and chat, reach out. I'll let you go. <laughs> I had the same thought, just another best. Oh man. Oh mommy, <laughs> here we go again. My my, how can I resist you? <laughs> oh man. The songs will be stuck in my head now. Rain, huh? <sighs> well, that's one of our major ones done. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're worried about our bad stuff. We're fine. Housekeeping services. All right, might as well do her. We haven't done her in a while. Total big nerds. That's you, oh. Phil. I'm Hi. Becky, Gorilla Maid of the Maid World. The type of work we do depends on how... Oh, it's you. As long as you request me, I'll do your housework. Hey. Sure. We haven't hung out with that one yet. Then I'll head over. <sighs> Alright, be thankful that I requested her. Thank you for using our service. Alright, you guys coming to hang out. Hey. Okay, it's Thursday. Oh, it looks like literally no one is available. Makoto. We could stand to make Makoto more friends. Hmm. I think we'll do the, the... Where's the shop? What's the shop we work at? Central Street? Hey, hey! Where's the convenience store? Nope, that's not the right way. This rate, the whole city will flood. Who cares about the fantasy? To work! God, what do you want to do? Oh, man. Oh, thank God. Oh, man. Oh! Senpai! Hey, I had no idea you work here. And that pink uniform, it looks great on you. I'm surprised. It does not. I'm unfortunate. I hate to break it to you. It does not. Sorry for troubling you. I'll see you at the cashier in a bit. Convenience stores have been lifesavers for when I get hungry in the middle of training. I can't help wanting to buy protein chocolate bars or jelly drinks. Sorry to chat in the middle of your work. Please keep it up. What a dork. I love her. Good to work out there. You gotta learn to be considerate with customers. Okay, but when do I learn about cat murderer? Wanna head back? Mm. I guess I gotta come back. Okay. Ah, you're back. Speech help. All right. Sure, let's hang out. Everyone. That you possess free will does not mean you can always do as you please. To make your decisions based simply on loss and gain is to act like a heartless machine. The reason so few people care about their fellow man is because so few have the energy to do so. He ain't wrong. We politicians have fallen short of our goal to change society. We need your support more than ever. That approach isn't gonna work. You have to get the voters more excited. You're going to completely lose the hearts and minds of the people. Again, what I'd like to say is, what? Councilman Matsushita. 
It's been so long since we last spoke, I wanted to stop by and see how you're doing. Oh, you have a high schooler volunteering for you, huh? Times have changed. Do you know about the Kuramoto children? Ah, well, at least you're honest, kid. I was a member of the Kuramoto children as well. Yoshida and I joined the same year. I made an amazing career change, going from a pro wrestler to a diet member. I was elected easily, but I had no idea what I was doing. I realized I wasn't elected on my own merit when I failed to be re-elected for a second term. That was true for the both of us. You made a great no. comeback, though. You're truly an inspiration. As are you, old friend. You've worked harder than anyone on the campaign trail. Oh, there's no need for false praise to impress the boy here. Yoshida's well informed about the inner workings of politics, so I'm sure he'll be a great teacher. However, I suggest you only do as he says and not as he does if you want to become a diet member. What does that mean? I'm guessing he doesn't know. You really think you can win the election by being completely honest and making good arguments? You've got to secure votes, or else you'll ne be forever known as no good Torah. Without honesty and good arguments, there can be no political justice. It's been a while since I've heard one of your grandiose speech speeches. You know. uh, tell me, what about Yoshida drew you in? His message. For a, you address matters quite directly for a young person. It seems you've been taught well. I intend right. to teach him everything I know. That's what we agreed on. I like the idea that he, uh, Joker, grows up to become a politician and actually uh, try and fix things in the traditionally correct way. Hey, Charlotte, welcome, and thanks for joining us. All right. <laughs> Boost. <laughs> Next in Persona 5, working in retail. <laughs> oh, goodness. <laughs> Boost your, re your patience to not stab a bitch. Yeah, I think I'm, I'm pretty good on that level. I have many years experience. How are things between you and old man Kuramoto? Yes. Still not on speaking terms. There's something I'd like to get your opinion on, so I'll be in touch. Very well. That reminds me, you may still just trust me because of what happened with the missing party funds, but I'm not the one who pointed the finger at you. That's all I'm going to say. Why did he have to mention that? My apologies, that's all for today. Well then, I'll see you again. Hello, thanks again for your help. What a mess. Past mistakes can really come back to bite you. It's hard to feel like you've ever truly escaped them. Some people can fight their way back up, like Matsushita, but many end up suffering under the weight of labels. Even after 20 years, I'm still nothing more than old, no good Torah. But I will not give up. It's true that I lost a lot, but I did learn a great many things along the way. Somewhere in the middle of it all, my old stubbornness was tempered into conviction, my one redeeming quality. That's why I want you to use your experiences to forge your own conviction. Yes, you're still young after all. You have a great deal more learning and growing to do. Uh, I ended up talking longer than I expected. Till next time. Making good progress in all these nerds I gotta be friends with. Uh, why do I gotta be friends with so many people, damn it? Ugh, my poor nose. Let me... too hot. Alright, did that work? Did that mute it? While I was blowing my nose? <laughs> Alright. Who we got? Use can on. Does the up to Kemi thing mean I can call her right now? That's just, that's why it's grayed out. Can't do it yet. Okay. Hmm. Looks like those two are our main choices, so... I think Yusuke is the one that's the least progress. Probably. Yusuke! Hello! Alright, let's hang out. Let's go somewhere fun. Yes. Let's see. 
He would probably like going to a fish place. Hmm, should we take him to the shrine or to the aquarium? We've been to the aquarium a couple times. Let's go to the shrine. When it says up, it means confidants guaranteed an upgrade on that visit. Okay, so it must mean the next time I can invite her, she'll go up. Oh. Uh, some of the pedestrians walking around because of... Okay, so in the East, uh, China, Japan, and elsewhere, it's far more common for people to just wear masks. One of the reasons why COVID didn't... Well, not didn't hit them as hard, but they got it under control more because it's socially normal to wear those masks more often. Like when you got a cold, bad air condition, you know, bad air and... Uh, what do they call those? You know, with smog and stuff. Um, and in the, in the West, you just don't see that, which I hate and will be rectifying in my own life forever now. I will always wear masks now. Oh, man. I find it hard to believe Harajuku is just outside. The silence in here is otherworldly. I see. That is why religion has historically tended to be a central motif in the art world. Perhaps artists picked up on something out of the norm. Now then, we should give an offering. Is there anything you wish to wish for? Good grades. Don't you think you should do something about that through your own effort? All you need to do is study harder. Reliance on a god. Hmm. It sounds sublime, yet is in fact quite ordinary. It is sophistry disguised as prayer. The unbalanced, the festering thing that exists in the depths of people's hearts may not actually be so bad. That reminds me, even a one yen offering is said to bring divine favors, yes. I'd offer more for increased luck, but even five yen's tough for me at the moment. Oh well, the gods will surely understand the dire situation of my wallet. Poor baby. You can have this. Way. After all, what goes around comes around. One must spend money to gain money. Oh. Ah, somebody dropped a 10 yen coin on the ground. How lucky! <gasps> ah. Man, it's hot. Let's see. I do all kinds of chores. Oh! Hi! Alright. My bond won't deepen yet, but it said it would. Oh well. Call her over! Then I'll head over! Thank you for using our service. <sighs> Thinking of heading out to the hideout. All right. Hey. Okay. Let's put up our new decoration. Hmm. Persona. Which one is she? I have a bunch of matching, but I don't know if I have everybody. Hmm, what are my personas? Got Faith, Moon, Death. Oh, I got two moons? I should, I should go see them and fix that. And I should probably hang out with them in general. Uh, where was that? There's one over here. Aw, thank you, Daniel. Thank you for the support. Time for some rehabilitation. You wish to see. perform an illusion. Well, we definitely don't want to get rid of Kaguya. Let's see, we don't have a justice. Fool is not necessary. We don't need fool. Justice we do, I think. Which who's justice? Chariot is 
Regi, priestess, we got a priestess. Hierophant, we got a hierophant. Hermit. So justice might be a good one to have. We could probably get rid of the hierophant because we're almost done with Ryuji. And then keep all the other ones. Not terrible, but not impressive. Select the skills you'd like Actually, to Actually, you know what? Here's what we'll do. Hmm. We're gonna itemize some, some of the crappy ones. It appears it so this is what it into a new form. Just double here with that. Pool, death moon. We don't need the moon or the pool because that's me. This shall be the result. Now be reborn. Sorry. Okay. Now let's go to the register. You view and summon this. personas. Those are all the fool ones. Hmm. Justice. We got a priestess. We got an emperor. Wait, no, we don't have an empress. But she's not on our team yet, so we don't need it yet. We got an emperor. We got a hair of pants. On is the lovers, so we should get a lovers probably. This a fee is required. Then accept this persona. Uh, justice. Is this what wow. you want? Wow. Wow. Buddy. You'll withdraw this persona. <laughs> the thing I love best is this, this character exists in other games, or at least I know it exists in SMT4. In SMT4, the angel's just naked, and of course in this one they had to give her clothes, but I think the clothes made it far more kinky, and like I think naked it looks far more like, oh, it's a pure angel, and now it's like, hmm, baby. <laughs> oh man. Okay, Fortune's the new guy, right? Strength? Who is strength? Uh, I don't know that we need strength. We got a death one. Temperance was the sister? Devil's that stupid what's-her-face. Uh, tower, I think, is a new one. Uh, who is... We're looking for... Teach, right? What is Teach. Let's see, what was teacher's name? There we go, Sadayo. And hers is, wait a minute. Wait a minute, they changed her name to Becky? Why is her name Becky? Oh, okay, no. Becky is her job name. Okay, I was like, wait, is her name Becky? Uh, what is her... Come on, what's her thingamajig? What is it? Where is it? Where do you list this? Here we go. Um, affiliation... Da, da, da. She's temperance. Okay. Give me a temperance. These are the paths you have walked. Here we go. Do I not have a single temperance one? Well, damn. That's unfortunate. Oh well. Done already. What? Um. Actually, can't I do by result? And it might let me create from what I can buy. Let's see if we can make. We can make a temperance, Mitra. Or Mithra, if you wanna see anybody else that might be more affordable. No? Oh well. I see. Ah, he looks a fun. Strong persona indeed. Select the skills you'd like to inherit. Doesn't matter, I'm not gonna use you. It will you. receive a fraction by my. Bye, Naga. Sorry, I love you, Isis. Oh man, it really is two of my favorite ones. Oh well, it's not like I'm using them. 
and wow, they came so ugly. Alright. Alright, let's go back. Finished. What? It is time, inmate. Okay. Can I talk to you? No? I guess we can't do that yet. Alrighty. So. Let's. Yusuke, Makoto, Kemi. Let's do Big Burger. Because we do need to work on that. We need to get guts. Um... Come on, get those guts. Fill your guts with burger. Thank you very much. <laughs> now then. That is obnoxious. <sighs> oh man. All right. Yep. <laughs> yeah. All right. We can make friends with you. All right. Nice. Well, we don't have to stuff our face full of burgers anymore. All right. Ah, uh, you're back. Hey. Let's see. How about a match? Are you much for arcades? Strolling through, I found myself drawn to it. Yeah, let's do it. Sorry for dragging you out here. I was out here gathering intel, and I noticed some patrons playing this. I did a bit of research. Apparently it's a pretty hardcore shooter game. Do you normally play games like these? All the time. Well, maybe you played this one before. I can only ask that you go easy on me. Damn, that's some accuracy. That guy with the brown hair isn't wasting a single shot. Yeah, Glasses isn't doing bad either, but he's definitely losing ground. Whew, my fingers are going to be sore tomorrow. What a realistic game. All right, no, no, no. Are you used to gunplay? Oh, I'm so wrong. You noticed? Well, I'll need as much practice as I can get if I'm going to take you out. Only a joke. I'm new to this, I'm afraid. Perhaps we'll chalk it up to beginner's luck. Still, this did feel a bit nostalgic for me. I had a toy gun like this when I was young, you know. All this reminded me of running around the house playing hero. I'm not totally certain, but thinking back, I suppose I must have. But there are different kinds of heroes, of course. Different stances they define themselves by. For example, one may stick to the vision of justice they believe in, even if others deny it. While another may simply do as others desire of them, seeking to be recognized and gratified as a hero. Which of these two fits more with your conception of a hero? Sticking to your justice. Well, I had a feeling you'd say that. But if nobody else wants the justice they fight for, isn't that just blind self-righteousness? Ah, sorry. I, I suppose that was a strange tangent. Pardon me. Whenever I talk with you, I can't help delving into these abstract topics. Ah, you big nerd with a gun fetish. Um, definitely, definitely has a gun fetish. I mean, that's just probably right. canon, right? He totally would. Danger King. Goodness, I work up a sweat playing that game. I must smell like the arcade now. I could use a shower. Why don't we call it a day? That's a weird way to phrase we that, but... Again. Those two are cute. I totally ship them. I wanted to express my gratitude again for today. Thank you for hanging out with me. I had quite a lot of fun. I don't play these games too often, so I honestly wasn't sure how well I'd do. Hopefully I didn't come off as too much of a novice. I wish I'd played better. Hmm, what would he want to hear? You can't raise his confidant again until next month after your reveals. Okay. 
so I don't need to hang out with him anymore. I'll save my time and hang out with other friends. Really, I'm honored you think so. I suppose I've always been quick to grasp the fundamentals of anything, but that's also been a concern for me. There's this constant pressure. Everyone expects me to be capable of anything, which is stressful in and of itself. Still, games are rather fun. It was quite a novel experience. Usually, I just read in my leisure time. Nerd! It offered more realism than I expected, and I was impressed by how immersive it felt. Usually, I really struggle with enjoying the same pastimes as my peers, but thanks to you, I had fun today. I hope you can join me again if you get the chance. Now I'll talk to you later. What a big frickin' nerd! park six feet apart because they're not gay <laughs> not like there's anything wrong with that though i guess it'd be better coming with a girl whatever i'm accepting my fate let's go over to a roller coaster i'm ready to scream it's all good i'm totally used to it after last time you better not cry understand let's go what a That shit was just as thrilling as always. My knees feel kind of weird. Does it feel like you're walking on clouds or something? Oh, hey, where'd they get this stuff you gotta use your muscles for? Let's blow off some steam. Man, couples freaking everywhere in this place, including us. I wonder what they're thinking about us. We're adorable. Wanna head back? Guess it's time for us loners to head home. No, you're not loner. You're my boyfriend. back. Alright. Oh. Alright, let's hang out with him. Forgot it was Sunday. Bill! <laughs> the conviction of a government is often tested during times of turmoil. However, the current administration refuses to discuss their plans for the future. Can we really accept such an utter lack of transparency? I've been hearing this type of criticism about the government a lot lately. That's because diet member Shido has been gaining popularity by saying the same thing. He's just echoing another politician's criticism of the government? Apparently. Whatever. First you stole party funds, now you're stealing ideas, no good Torah! Stop talking all big, you ex-convict. Ugh, hmm. it seems I've drawn the ire of the audience again. He's claiming those who have made mistakes in the past shouldn't get a second chance. What can I say to that? Got something to say to me, kid? Yup. What's up with the kid? Why, you little punk? Yes, I am no good, Tora, and I have made mistakes. Yes, I am unpopular and powerless, but that has nothing to do with my arguments. These are things I've learned from my hardships. Yes. You can ridicule me all you want, but I will continue to oppose what is wrong with this world. Today's speech ended up being filled with quite passion. Quite unexpected, I might add. The highlight was your yelling. Very promising, but don't overdo it. You should avoid making enemies whenever possible. Okay, that's all for today. 
You two are amazing. I've been wrong this whole time. Even though someone's failed in the past, it doesn't mean they can't try again. That's all I wanted to say. Please you. wait. Thank you. Thank you. That is what I wanted to say. You're a strange one, just like that kid. Mm -hmm. I learned something from your dauntless spirit today. I have a bad habit of getting flustered whenever someone calls me no good Torah, but you see me as someone of value, so I refuse to cower to criticism in front of you. Today you taught me I must have more confidence in my arguments. Yay! Wow, we're getting up there! All right. Soon, maybe we'll have everybody to about half. My way of thinking uh, changes when I'm with you. Perhaps it's the influence of your youthful spirit. My apologies, it seems we're out of time. I shall ask you again another time. Hello, thanks for all your hard work today. Thanks to you, I've remembered something very important. Now that I think about it, ever since the scandal, I felt alone and helpless, like the whole world was against me. Perhaps I got too used to the constant judging and critique, but I realized I'd overlooked something crucial. I'd forgotten the people who support me and how encouraging it feels simply to be in their presence. Perhaps it seems too obvious or too trite, but I hope you remember to cherish that, too. Exactly. Sounds like you've already learned the lesson. I will engrave it into my heart. I can't let myself forget it again. Well, I'll be counting on you for my next speech, too. See you soon. I want to go look for a book, something I'm curious about. I'm going to Booktown. Sounds like my favorite place. I would love to go to Booktown. I would love to live in Booktown. All right. All right. That place looks so great. Excuse me. I'm interested in cognitive, cognitive science, the field Futaba's mother was researching. I doubt we'll find any public information, but maybe an older academic journal may mention it. Let's get cracking. Thank you. I do hope we find something. I want to learn more about cognitive science while we wait for Futaba to regain her strength. If only we could understand it in more depth, maybe we could solve the mystery of the metaverse. It would make traversing it easier, too. <gasps> oh... Hello. Goodbye. <laughs> oh. Excuse me, please wait. Was there something you wanted to say to him? No, nothing in particular. I was just surprised to see him here. I didn't mean to intrude between you two. No um... need to be so considerate. He's just carrying my books for me. Is she a friend of yours? She's my fellow shogi warrior. Warrior? We just play shogi together. Oh, I thought she'd think that was fun. Is she the professional shogi player you mentioned? The master strategist? Strategist? I see. I admit I only know the rules, but I'm intrigued to learn how a professional shogi player thinks. Is that a book on shogi tactics? Oh yes, I come here to purchase old so shoji tragedy books from time to time. Shoji strategy. Pardon me for asking, could you teach me some strategies? I believe this knowledge would benefit me greatly in the future. <gasps> Best friends! Woohoo! Sure, if you'd like. Well, if it's about shogi, then to attack you will need to be creative with your approach and sacrifice pieces with no remorse. So planning on enticing your opponent to focus on your sacrificial pieces so you can advance a counterattack. Yes, yes, you seem to have a talent for this. Another strategy is to bait using your, draw your opponent to your side of the board. <laughs> I see, that way you can surround them and you two are hitting it off. Sorry, uh, what was she saying? It was so interesting, I was lost track of time. I'll catch up with you later. Could you look for the book we discussed? Aww, girlfriends! So cute. Shall we return home? Oh my god, I love it. Yes! So adorable. <sighs> I love seeing girls hanging out with other girls. You love to see it. <sighs> Man, it's hot. Alright, go, 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 go. 
one more week. We don't What's the <sighs> How many info I'm standing by? I guess we should hang out with her. It's been a minute. Phil! Oh, honey. You sure come here a lot. I really don't mind it, but keep yourself in check, okay? Hey, we have hey. a target we haven't identified, right? Maybe you can gather some more info while you're working. Oh yeah, we could work here too for the thingamajig, but we could do that any night. I need to hang out with Ilya. Is this weather a result of climate change? Hey! Alright, give me the details about the Kamashita incident. A bulletin board, huh? So the calling card they used was different. That's a scoop. That kind of information usually doesn't see the light of day. You have any photo or videos of it? Is she my mite? Nice, you have some great connections. But seriously, <laughs> the phantom thieves of heart. They sound like kids on a playground, not valiant fighters for society. They act all high and mighty, but I'm not sure they're really worth much in the end. Yep. What? You don't think they're really virtuous, do you? In my line of work, there's no clearer sign of deception than goodwill. You know, like the shady actions of a charitable organization or the actual criteria of a peace prize. Same goes for the Phantom Thieves. You just have to learn to take some things with a grain of salt. Come on, don't be such a downer. It's the truth. There you go again. You used to be so positive. <sighs> Shut it. I don't care about the past. Give me some sushi. We're all out. Why don't you go back to covering politics? No can do. I've been permanently reassigned to the culture and entertainment departure. Department. What a crappy company. I mean, it's been a year since the incident. Oh, by the incident, I mean... Don't say another word. This has nothing to do with my source. Sorry. Ugh, I'm already sobering up. Give me a refill, Lala-chan. Jeez, you're such a child sometimes. You want a drink? You can have some of mine if you want. Ahem. <laughs> That's some scowl you've got. Anyway, why are you coming to a bar if you can't even drink alcohol? I like the gay atmosphere. That makes sense. Feel free to visit... Excuse me. Feel free to visit whenever you want, honey. That makes sense. Feel free to visit whenever you want is totally code for... Aw, you're a baby gay that needs a refuge, aren't you? You're welcome, baby gay. Seriously, the only reason you're so uptight. Well, at least I know you're going to be pretty useful. I'm not all that interested in the thieves myself, but keep the info coming. All right. What's taking so long, Lala Chan? Where's my drink? Do they call you Escargo because you move slow as a snail? Rot a booze. A certain sloshed reporter drank it all. Can't you just go buy more? I'll wait for you forever. Just kidding. <laughs> oh, God. What a mess. What a mess. Well, then. Lala is presented as a, uh, a cross-dresser. Not entirely clear if they're trans or what. I kind of always headcanon them as, like, a trans person, but I don't know if that's canonical or not. Uh, night, Phil. Have a good one. Thanks for joining us. Tell you the truth, I've been troubled lately. Alright. I'm gonna meet up with Makoto today. Hey! Alright. I think we'll call it there. We've made some good progress. Uh, I'm Let's gonna... Do it hit the sack early because it's been a long day but thanks for joining me and thanks to everyone that donated and supported during the stream i know maddie donated earlier daniel did thank you guys so much uh and thanks to our members who keep the channel running like phil and daniel and maddie and jeff uh all you folks are so amazing needle pop uh who else was here Thank you guys so much for the support and for uh, your assistance in keeping the channel alive. If you'd like to support the channel, you can do so through the links in the description. You can donate, become a member, buy my books, all that jazz in the links in the description. 
Uh, tomorrow, we'll probably go back to doing our Chinese novel reading. Tomorrow's Wednesday, so that would be Heaven Official's Blessing. I've been practicing how to say the names. Oh, Tintins. Thank you for the support, Tintins. Um, so yeah, we'll go back to reading that. Maybe do a little uh, discussion of Chinese uh, words beforehand. Show y'all what I've learned. Uh, and yeah, I'm going to go to bed. Thanks again for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye!